Hi, my name is Bob Stojkovic and I'll be showing you my new script called Quick Preview. My script lets you turn on and off groups of layers, effects and masks. Okay, let me show you how to work with the script. Go to Window, then Quick Preview. As you can see, it's a dockable script. Uh, we have four groups. We can load and save the groups. We can remove, from, remove items from the list. We can add. We can delete the whole list. Or we can refresh and at the end turn on and off the groups. Okay, I have here a small animation and as I scrub through it's not real time and when I work on specific animations I like to work in real time and this is where this script comes in handy. So I'll select vignette, grain and letterbox and I'll select group 1 and I'll add, add it to the group. Now as you can see if I turn off the group I can work in real time with animation and really make my animation perfect and when I'm satisfied with the animation I can just turn this button on and there you go I have my finished video prepared to render. One cool feature is it, it's working with pre-coms also so if I go into this pre-com watermark and select these two I can add it to the group one and now in the final comp if I turn it off you will see that watermark is turned off but not here but actually in the pre-comp so that's that's a pretty cool feature okay next this script works with effects also so if I go to the group 2 and let's select the circle and click plus it works with masks also so if I select the mask it's on subtract and I click plus if I turn it off you will see the mask turned to none and the effect is turned on and I click turn on effect is back on and the mask was previously returned to the value you set and at the end you can save the selections all the groups selection set successfully saved now if I quickly save the project file and reopen the After Effects You will see that if I click load, I will load everything I made previously, so I don't have to, so I don't have to select it and add it again. So that's a pretty cool feature. Also, if I want to remove these two, I can select it and click remove, click remove, and now it's not, uh, it's not affecting the watermark anymore. I can also delete the whole group if I click the delete button, the E L and also add these two layers to the uh, to the group and if I delete by accident the black solid I didn't remove it here first I can just click the refresh button and it will remove itself here okay I hope you like the script bye bye